11, we are just over a week away from the scariest night of the year, and one local business is taking advantage of the spooky atmosphere. RTV6's Jason Strong has more on the ghost at the Story Inn. I saw nothing but the bottom edge of a skirt and two bare feet, and then it was gone. I heard a female voice call my name. There's many spirits walk these grounds. The story behind Story Inn dates all the way back to the 1850s, when the property was deeded by the government over to local doctor George Story. George later moved to Illinois, but some of the inn's guests say that his wife, the Blue Lady, has been here ever since. Guest books going back to 1980 from this very room, before there was an internet, before people could talk about it, before there was Facebook, before they could blog about it, before we had every ghost tracker society doing studies up here, we had people writing in those books and they were from years apart in different books giving consistent reports of seeing the same phenomenon. Rick Hofstetter, the current owner of the inn, is a self-professed skeptic, but he says visitors come from all over hoping to catch a glimpse of the blue lady. But worry not, according to bar manager Danny Ham, there is no need to fear the lady in blue. These are happy spirits. This is their home. They wouldn't harm anybody. I do believe that it is the blue lady. I, I truly believe she is a prankster. So whether she's a prankster or the jokes on all those that believe, it's up to you to decide. From Story, Indiana, I'm Jason Strong, RTV6. Ooh, if you want more information on this, on the story in, or to check out <laughs> the ghost yourself, we've posted full details on our website, theindychannel.com. Scary.